You know, folks, the sad truth is white America has never, ever been outraged by racism. They're going to say, oh, he's stereotyping white people. That's not right. I, I'm just speaking in terms of the collective. And if the shoe fits, fucking wear it. White people have never been fucking outraged at racism. Not at our racism. Never once. I've never heard of white people outraged. How many white people were outraged at Trump's racism? You know what white people do when they hear racism? From their president, from their neighbor, it doesn't matter. When white people hear racism, they do about three things. Usually, they suddenly shut the fuck up and get quiet. They get silent. Or they run and they hide and they avoid it. Or they deny it. Oh, that's not true. Oh, he he's, he's a good man. But, 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 I'm not racist, but, he's not racist, but... They fucking deny it, avoid it, or they remain silent, or they're not doing those three things, then they're perpetrating it. In a nutshell. It's what we fucking white Americans do, and it's what we always have fucking done. There's never been any goddamn outrage from white America collectively about Trump and his fucking racism. So that's why, because white America stance, why Trump was able to normalize open racism. He was able to make racism overt again. Popular. Fashionable. Trendy. <laughs> this is what Trump did. After a black president, white America was happy to oblige a con artist, a clown, a malignant narcissist, a fucking psychopath, a crook, a criminal, a lying sack of shit who told 30,000 fucking lies. White America was so happy. They lusted after Trump. Before he was elected and Trump said, Mexicans are rapists and drug dealers. White America got wet. They got excited. They got turned on. They really did. Because they found their fucking racist. I'm being honest. If that's not true, then why the fuck did white America elect him? And Latino America, and a few other people, Asians too, a couple of blacks, but mainly, largely, white America elected that racist motherfucker. And when they heard him spew racist, they knew they had found that white man that would lead them back to white nationalism, and white pride, and white power, and white privilege, and white entitlement. White supremacy would continue this great tradition and heritage that we have as white people in America. They knew they had found their racist hero in Trump. And they elected him with all their might. And they tolerated that lying sack of shit through a pandemic that's got hundreds and hundreds of thousands of people killed because of that lying sack of shit. White America all along, quiet, tolerating it because he's their racist. And white America has always thought the lies of white supremacy is helping them somehow. Is it really fucking helping you? We just had a goddamn insurrection because of white supremacy. Because you wanted a fucking narcissistic, psychotic, racist. You had to have a racist so bad. You didn't care that he was a narcissist. You didn't care that he was a con. You didn't care that he was a lying sack of shit. You just had to have the most racist candidate after a black president. White supremacy is not fucking helping us. White people have no credibility, no integrity, no character. No humanity. That's a perception of white people because we protect white supremacy and we've done it for hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of fucking of years. That's how we are perceived. We're not trusted by brown and black people. And that's our own goddamn fucking fault. Because our reputation precedes us. So until we fix this shit, white America, destruction will continue. The chaos will continue. The toxicity, the dysfunction, the chaos. Maybe a civil war. 
God knows what's coming if we don't stop allowing racism. People like Rudy Giuliani, Trump, Jeff Hawley, Marjorie Green, just to name a few, Ted Cruz, all these ignorant racist motherfuckers should be fucking kicked the fuck out of office, but you know what? They won't be. And they should be impeached. Trump should be fucking impeached. But he won't be. Because white people have no outrage toward racism, and we never have. As a matter of fact, not only do we not have outrage, we fucking want it, and we fucking support it. That's the goddamn fucking truth. We've created our own fucking destiny of hell. Thank you, white America. Face your fucking racism. Once again, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking to white people. They don't fucking listen. They're so goddamn worried about losing their fucking greed and their fucking white privilege. White people don't give a fuck. Because they've been taught that shit. From birth. Grow the fuck up. Take some white racial responsibility and grow the fuck up. Fix your fucking country. <laughs>